All right. You just gotta pop around the corner here, go down the alley, and we'll be at Great Gal's place. If you've been following my channel, you'll know who I'm talking about. It's pretty dark. <laughs> Cozy does this dude look? Can't see me. Can you see me now? <laughs> How cozy is this little spot? Just have a nap. Do your video editing. So bye D. Hello. <laughs> My funny boy. Come here girl. Come here. Hey sweetie. Come here. Come here, girl. Come here. You're nicer. <laughs> She's scared now. Pet young kid, no. No, I walk. Oh, I'll count. I walk. Oh, my new name. Tom Yang, Tom Pam. She made this soup. <laughs> what do you eat in the rice fields? That's how you neighbor. Can you come Somebody, hello, time for some dinner. <laughs> and we give up. <laughs> we come for to see see the show over here with Joe. <laughs> oh my goodness! It look like I got a studio in here. <laughs> How was your um, sauna? The sauna is awesome. Sauna is awesome. Um, right now I'm just scared about this because it is looking like it's going to just like burst into like an open, big open infection sore. Um, and I'm like... Did you buy that stuff that I told you to get? The saline solution? Uh -huh. No. You should. That's I should. To keep it clean. That's because right now like with the weather it's really, it's really hard to fight an infection, you know. Hot, humid, hard to stay dry. Mm -hmm. So that's why I'm like, okay gonna be very careful so the staph infection can really mess you up you know but you know what their their medicine is really strong <laughs> you sure that help dry it up quick. are you gonna have some oh you got food over here already uh-huh oh i got some more food because she's making some soup and i don't yeah. think that's gonna be uh, enough. Uh, no enough for you because you're a big boy we should order some fun home <laughs> yeah no? Um, the one that we have earlier, there's still some left, a whole bunch left. I put it in the fridge, it's probably still good. I thought it was good, it was different. It was like, some, I, I, I kind of like just the yeah, normal, sure. normal everyday sometimes. Sometimes I get like real crazy with putting a million things in there. Mm -hmm. Awesome. I filmed. Okay, so let's taste this. Don't buy the nun, beautiful nun over here is made for us. Get a little fish. Mm. That's really good. Wow. Mm, I just got this fish out of the Mekong River. Fish is excellent and the flavors are so well balanced. Wow. So she passed cooking? She passes the cooking test. <laughs> like a lot of times you can be heavy on some flavors, but it's like so balanced. You go from mm. one flavor to the next. It's like you get a little sourness, but then you get the nice herbal flavors in there as well. Mm. And pak kanyang, mm. oh, <laughs> <Pak> kanyang. <laughs> <laughs> I don't remember how it's 
Let's put the onion, guys. Mm, mm, mm. I forgot. There's this one in here. It's very lovely aroma. But of course, we got some steamed bamboo shoots. Mm. And then, well, I'm getting all. I mean, we're gonna eat all of this. <laughs> I hope so. Oh my. It's your favorite. She knows my favorites. <laughs> this is really true. You <laughs> just two, three bags full of <laughs> Lao food, like traditional, just lab and grilled meats. And a second ago, I was like, "Where's the home? Oh, we gotta. We're missing one thing. <laughs> we have yeah. some in the fridge, actually. We, we should bring that out. <laughs> Let's check out our lab. Probably, just grab this from the market. Mm -hmm. hmm. Awesome. I've never tasted her food before. Love you. Love you. Love you. So, pork lard. What else do we get here? Kai Baba fish eggs. Do you like it? I like it. So yeah. bad. So oh. nice. Oh, I haven't had this. This is so bad. Oh, you've never had so bad before? We should try this. This is one I haven't <laughs> had yet. There's so many dishes. Uh, even though I, I like to have a variety, it's sometimes you just aren't in the mood at a particular time when you come across it and then this has become oh, Joe's favorite oh really? I didn't think he liked really? it but he tried it a week ago and he's been eating it every day okay I'm not gonna lie I haven't I say a lot of with most foods I say this is my first time to try it because it is the first time in Laos I've tried it in other parts of the world uh, so I don't know I've had it where it's been really strong and uh Still always been good, but let's give it a shot. I've never seen it like this. Usually it's like, the uh, way I seen it was like pieces of fish. This is like minced. Is it really sompa or is it just kaipa? Mm -hmm. Sompa. Oh, wow. It's a bone, so I don't like it. Okay, I need to do better here with the film. <laughs> there we go. I'm not sure about it. Not sure? Mm -mm. Let's give it a shot. True to the name. Still, it's good. It's not overwhelmingly sour. Pretty good level of sour. Um, yeah, that's so bad. Sour fish <laughs> dish. Uh, sometimes there's a bunch of bones in it, which is a pain, but if it doesn't have bones, it's even better. Great flavors. Mm, solid. Let's move on to our love, my favorite dish. Wow. So far, I've really liked it. I love it. I love sap soup. Sap soup, and I love I had potato soup, but I. <laughs> lob is my favorite. You do it, if you get a lob right, it's just all the flavors. You got the roasted, roasted rice powder. It's been crushed up. You get that nice smoky. You got sour from the limes, spicy with the pep, the chilies. You usually have mint in there, so nice, like, fresh, minty, herbal aroma. Salty, savory. Goodness gracious. Oh. Oh, wow. Joe have to have pork. He doesn't eat this food. It's like the bone Buang. If you weren't sure <laughs> what we're talking about. Bon pa ba. Ani ani koi pa. Bon pa. Ani lap lap mu ani lap pa. Oh, ini pa. Oh, ini pa. 
The lady that I yum, yum, got yum. my food from, she's only cooked on the weekday. So far. So far. So this is like everything has food. been incredible flavors, and as goes with lab, lava is no different. An amazing dish. Mm -hmm. Let's see how what their take on it is. It's okay. I'm okay with it. It's very good. It's salt here. All right, well, let's put it this way. My favorite flavor profile is usually for lava is going to be uh, nice and smoky from the the rice powder and sour and a little salty. This is heavy on the salty side. Not very sour. Still good. Different take on it. Pretty salty. But nice, generous pieces of fish. Mm, <laughs> I'm going to take the good one. I'm going to take the fish eggs. <laughs> You like the fish eggs? Oh yeah. Really? It's like the Let's best. see. Oh my goodness, you really like that bit? I'm pretty sure that's the bit I always take out and throw the dogs. So so bitter. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> she said, mm. <laughs> This is good stuff too, dried dried meat. This is really good. You just give me some of this with some sticky rice in here. You got a meal. มองว่าก็เป็นน้ําได้หมอนะก็แล้วก็เข้าไปแน่ใจก็เข้าไปเข้าคิดยานแล้วเราเอาลาบไปได้เออเงี้ยบ่ค่อยอย่างนั้นจ
And it's still, compared to back home, it's nothing. But, um, it's a lot of medicine. And sometimes they give you a lot of stuff you don't even need. Well, most of the time, they give you a lot of stuff you don't even need. You need to go through all the medicine. I went through all of it when I got home. I found the, the, the antibiotics that he wanted me to take. There's two different ones. And I found, like, the steroids to, like, help my immune system or whatever. But then there was other ones that were, like, paracetamol, ibuprofen, I don't know, gastrointestinal, like, help with the ulcers, like, upset stomach stuff. Like, what is all of this? <laughs> it happens a lot like that. <laughs> I don't know if you remember, I was on medication for uh -huh. 10, 10 days. Uh -huh. It's from that place. He really? gave me a lot it's so, of medicine. It's too much. Like, Back of it. But it's been like this everywhere I've been in Asia. They give you this huge bag and then you get loads of like the generic stuff that I don't need all this Pepto Bismol. <laughs> like, mm -hmm. They give me a codeine, Pepto Bismol, like all this stuff for upset stomach as well. My intestines, like, nah. I don't need painkillers. I just need stuff to fight the infection and then I move. We can. We'll be fine. I didn't mind it because. They kept me working in the yard 10 days straight and I don't feel tired. <laughs> like I dig 10 pickle holes one day. I'm like, how did I get all this done in one day? <laughs> well guys, there's a lot of food here. I'm leaning and trying to eat and, and uh, introduce everything to you guys on one booty cheek. <laughs> so we're going to enjoy some food. Thanks for joining us. We'll see you in the next one. Bye.